What up, nerds? It's round two here. It's Matt and Wes. And, uh, I'm on the play. On the bridge. Your turn. We'll shock in a grave. Go to 18. We will tap it. Maybe. We will. Hot sneeze. He's doing it. He's doing it. Yep, we're gonna toss it. What is this? I can't read that. <laughs> what? What do you mean? Just a basic toss it. Alright, what are we doing? We're stomping, we're croxing, we're. Who's this guy? Giant sorcery patrol will deal damage to a permanent. Or a player deals double that damage, and he is a giant. Okay. Hmm. Um, I think I. Giants, 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 giants. I guess we take bone crusher. Right on. Tough choices. All set. Yeah. I'm gonna glimpse. Yep. Pick it up and flip the card over. Um, swing for two. Eighteen. Tap two. Play deadly dispute. Mm -hmm. Kill this guy. Here's treasure. Draw two cards. <laughs> uh, we'll sack the treasure. Play shambling guest. To you. I've literally had the worst draws I think I've ever <laughs> had in my entire life. Oh, lordy. Coast. Mm hmm. Just like a regular token. Okay. He's not a decayed. Let's go to my turn. I'm gonna pick up the crocs. Yeah. I need to flip cards while I think. <laughs> So we're both going to mill three first. Okay. So one, two, three. 
Calamity Bearer, Fable, Bone Crusher. And then I draw, you discard. Land, land, eternal heart strength. One card's energy. Five. I drew the one, so I have five with that one. Terrible for magic. That's right. I'm gonna copy the claim as a mirror that's in my guard. Yep. So it's a 4-4 four, four claim to be Yeah. Here you can use a I got a copy. Copy token. Okay, but now I can fit this right. Choose two. That's all I got. Oh, that's pretty good. Have a mana value? Uh, it will be the mana value of claim. Okay, okay. so it's a four. Okay. So, um, I'm not blocking. Take two. Three, two. <laughs> Definitely have a fatal push. <laughs> Fellows. All right. This has been the worst oh, yeah. land draws yeah. of my entire life. All set. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 22 in here. Oh my god. Glimpse. Heads flashback. Yep. If I have a giant heads flashback. Mm -hmm. The blue in there just for clips. And the Amon Cat. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's like it works. Uh, so I think this is a game. Push. Mm hmm. Spite. I'm gonna discard a Thoughtseize. Or, sorry, it's not discard, it's put on bottom. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna draw a card with that. Mm -hmm. And the uh, six and eight. No. Double, double. Yeah. So that's 12. Oh, yeah, that's 12. And then oh, that's 16. Because double, double? each one will double. If a giant control uh, deals double damage. So it's double, double because you have two giants. Yeah. yeah. No, because I have two Calamity Bears specifically. Um, so this will do three, double to six, double to 12, and this will do four, double to eight, double to 16. So it's 28 damage. Yeah. That's crazy. Good combo. I mean, it's a, it's a five three. Deal damage to so a permanent or player that deals double yeah, that damage. To that. So you have double, yeah, double, 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 double. Yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, so. I can't believe I'm like finding two removal spells to waste on those things. Uh, but four fatals. Was it all four? No, it was three. Yeah, three and then a, and then a, spike. a spike. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was doing a couple of matches on Arena and have Fable in there too. So then, like, when you have the double Fable, I did this just for fun, just for the memes. I would like make eight copies of reflections on their end step, and then on my turn I copy Calamity Bearer eight times, yeah. and then attack for like forty thousand, <laughs> just to see if I could crash the game. <laughs> Somebody else did that. I don't know if Fable was like bugged for a little bit or something, but they were they were. I think they were like tapping on their turn. I thought it was sorcery only or something, but they were were basically making like a dozen. Um, <laughs> Like treasure makers, I think, is what they were oh. doing. I forget. It was a little while ago, and I was like, that's, I don't think that's how that's supposed to work. Like, I, I play Fable, and 
right. Like, it, I know how it works, and I don't think that's it. Alright, um... Huh. I did have a fit. <laughs> I figured. <laughs> I figured. Just taking out the fun cards that I wanted to play. Yeah, I'm kind of taking out, like, I don't know if you're really that aggressive. I feel like you should be. Like, you just had the three of Reaver draw. And the two land draw. You were 4 1. This, this deck is a. Uh, jank. <laughs> you did warn me that it was a jank. To be fair, this is definitely jank. It's not a meta deck at all. It did its thing, though. It did its thing. Yeah. One time. Yeah. I mean, Let's see if it keeps going. Granted, it was against a, a jank deck, but. And on a bad draw. <laughs> Yeah, on a land yeah, stuff. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, that yeah. Is still this seems like it. Like, they're 1-1s, like, one, one, you just take one a bunch of times until you like, yeah, have an answer but somewhere. I'd be dumb if you just put it in. How draw bad my draws are, it really has me considering not being on the play. I mean, there is something to be said for having an extra card, especially yeah. if I mulligan. True. Then you're up two cards, and it's it's like an uphill battle. Yeah, until Jank deck doesn't do. Right, <laughs> until you get stuck on two lands or something. Uh, I think. I think I. Still I don't know. Yeah. I think attacking with just the shambling gas was better. Than both of them. Than both of them, because if I block the, I mean, you still get to fatal push it, but you don't get the treasure then. So I don't know. That's okay. That's still. You really needed the treasure, though. I did really need the treasure, but I, if I could have also killed your yeah. guy that killed me, then he wouldn't have killed me. So that's true. That is how that works. <laughs> I played so many different variations of zombies that I wanted to try like a dimmer build because they never really work. Like they're fun to play, but they. It's, I mean, I think that's. More or less true from all the tribal decks. Isn't that, aren't they trying to rename it as something else? Not, not calling it tribal now. Oh, I don't know. That would be silly. Yeah. <laughs> tribal is like pretty much ingrained in. Right. And it's also a card type. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> White humans. I mean, that's like the best. Gotta be the best tribe, right? No. Giants. Giants. Hey! <laughs> Matt breaking the meta with giant tribal. Oh, definitely not breaking it. I just feel bad being the, the shop person that, like, I could just sleeve up the best deck in the format and sure. just wipe the floor with everyone. Yeah. But I feel bad doing that. Yeah. Well, that was why I didn't bring Rakdos to me, too. I was like, eh, it's... Yeah. I remember when I played the other game, I just like, man, I... I'll be able to play. Yeah. It's <laughs> better or worse. But then it's also kind of frustrating. You, you, you know what's going on here. Like, losing uh, every <laughs> round, you know? Yeah. Well, that one we got with 3-0, and then the next we got with 2-2, two and two, so it's... Like, yeah. Sometimes the cards just fall where they do. Giants? Oh, God. Um, yeah, I think you just take the... Uh, three list if you control it. Mm -hmm. You just take the Fable. Okay. Because it's broken. Yo. Copy Giants. <laughs> yeah, just copy Giants. They're not legendary. Play the Fatal Push. They're the Fatal Push. The Blood Crypt. Good turn. Go ahead and play the Fatal Push. I don't have mana for it. I mean, I guess if I shock that in. Uh, shock that, go to 16. Uh, oh, yeah, that was a thought season. Yeah. 16. Reaver. Yep. Yeah. It's on there somewhere. A little one point. Honestly, I should have played that first and then that shocked in. Because then I could foretell that. Glad you didn't. Yeah, that was 
a mistake on my part. Land for turn. Yeah. 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 Just play Death Baron. Gives everybody else 1 1 and Death Touch. Okay. Which means the 4. Take go. two. Yep. Eighteen. I need a land. Huh. Not a land. Yes. Tracking and go for it. Attack for one. 17. <laughs> Bid 15 on my draw. Yep. Nice. Uh, I'm foretell this. Okay. How's foretell work again? I can cast it for the foretell cost. Okay. And it's currently in exile. And you're not supposed to know what it is, but you know what it is. Yeah. I saw you cast it. Camera ready. Untap. Draw. I suppose if like I had other foretell cards in the deck, then maybe I would like pick that up so you don't know if it's Quake Bringer or like Behold, but mm. it is the only foretold card in the deck. Oh, you're at 16. Yeah, thanks. I remember everybody else's now, but I forget my own. Right? Um, Story of my magic career. With both of them. Let me tap two, Deadly Dispute. Make the treasure, draw the two cards. Lane four, I go to 20. Play a land for turn. And then I think we. Plus one, plus one. Two. Eight. Is it too late? Oh, yes, yes. Sorry, like. One plus one for each zombie in my graveyard. I just have the Lazo because you exile death parent. Cast Brotherhood's end. Okay. Three damage each creature. Okay. Um, pass. Two. Tap. I'm gonna draw my fourth land, but it's gonna be like Dark Slick Shores. Come and tap. Channel the mm -hmm. Takanuma Mill 3. And then your turn. Okay, 3, by the way. Oh, yeah, because I have one. Yeah, thanks. Mill 3, bring somebody back. I think we bring the Diagraph back. And then tap 1, 2, 
sack the treasure. Bring him back out. One, two, so he gets plus two, plus two. And then we swing at you for four. Go to two in my draw step. Yep. Well, we traded getting stuck yeah. on. <laughs> Both of them weren't really games of magic. No. <laughs> Incredible watching. Please That's start right. an interesting conversation in the comments right. if you are having a less than rousing time watching this match. I personally will chime in. He will. He reads the comments. I do. You can ask him for his deck list. He'll post it. <laughs> yeah. You don't, they don't want this deck list. Someone will. <laughs> Someone always does. Oh, man. It, my last zombie deck list wasn't bad. It just didn't win. Like, it was a good deck. I drew a lot. I mean, I zombies of didn't win there. No, they didn't. <laughs> you, you made me t take out my fun cards and put in cards that... Children won there. Stop your cards. Something like Quakebringer kind of... It doesn't really shut down Shieldred on my side, but you can't gain life. Sure. So, like, it, it seems like a reasonable play. Yeah. And they trade, because power toughness is... Oh, it seems like it's a decent card, and then it does stuff in the graveyard, too, so... Quakebringer does. Yeah, if it's in the graveyard and you have a giant in play, it'll upkeep two damage. Mm. To me? So, yeah. That's and then if you have Calamity Birds, a giant, so dumps you for four every turn. Giant Tribal, I have not... Man, I've seen some, some funny decks. Uh, I made it up to Mythic in Arena, and then I got sent down to, like, Plat 4. And that's where just everybody's playing these like meme decks. Yeah, meme yeah. decks, but they like they have a combo that wins. And uh, so I was like on the last ticket platform, and then I played like five decks in a row. It was like Grease Fang hit its combo. Uh, it was just like all of the combo decks all in a row, and they all hit them. And uh, I was like, oh god, somebody somebody saved me. I don't have time to grind this out. <laughs> Did you see the article? This was a while ago, but someone made a bot. They had like. They basically played whatever land was left facing in their hand furthest over. They'd play that and then cast whatever spell was left. Oh, really? And then if they could cast another spell, they would. Yeah. And then every combat, they'd attack all of the player no matter what. <laughs> Full send. Full send. <laughs> and if they ever had to block, it was the left creature would block the left <laughs> creature that's attacking. Oh, my god. And they made it to Mythic in, like, some... What? Yeah, they made Did it they to Mythic. Did they just play, like, mono red or something? They just had a bot going. Yeah. But what, was, like, what was the deck? Uh, I think it was mono red. Okay, that would make um, the most sense. Like yeah. spells attacking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and they ended up making mythic. I don't remember how many matches it oh took. A couple play. hundred. Yeah, play first. Yeah. <laughs> I'll try it. Um, no, I can't. So yeah, just I don't know. I can see with mono red. I mean, mono red, you're just. Whatever you empty your hand anyway by right. turn like four or five, so yeah. I guess it would only really matter if uh, it was like spectacle. But if it was botting and attacked and did damage, it would, it would cast whatever. It would uh, cast everything pre combat, so yeah. it didn't matter. Oh, would it cast a uh, second main phase too? I don't think like if, if you so. could, you know, like if you I don't play, think uh, so. I think it was cast a spell attack in the turn, okay, because I don't think after maybe it would check. I don't think the bot was sophisticated enough to check, yeah. Because, like, you're not drawing a card in combat. Yeah. So the only reason would be if it's spectacled, and I don't know. I don't know. If it, like, turn two, you could, like, double skewer the critics or something, you know? And yeah. Blast out six damage. Oh, I didn't. I didn't pump up 30 lands into this deck if I ever play it again. I got 24, and round one, I, I had a six lander and mulligan, five lander, kept, oh put one back, cast a glimpse, and saw three lands. I guess I gotta keep this, and then throw this. I had a uh, spot left now. 
pass. Yeah. So I was trying yeah. to keep up as many spells as possible, but yeah. so it, yeah. and, like, it wasn't my base. Dark Slick. Play. But at that point in time, I mean, our favorite card tonight. Oh boy. Um, not certain. Uh, you. you had the Odawara, war, I'm assuming, after the first. Okay. Right. Yeah, there's two, 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 two to two guys yeah. 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 Or no. Yeah. So we both mill three. Yeah, No. No, that's a lot. I don't know. Yeah. You just I heard I draw. All I had yeah. was, was all I had was I draw two and the Bosegu. So if I draw two, like there's stuff I can take out of my gap. Do you want to know what I build or jump here? Spill Pierce, Shambling Guest, Pathway. Yeah, I had Glimpse, Swamp, Black. So, Glimpse isn't too bad. Though. No. Um, as we play Necromancer. Okie dokie. And what do we name? Yeah, I don't actually remember the names of your cards because I write them down. But I think I take the 3 4 double guy. There is one in my hand. Okay. Um, you can if you want. So there's one in my hand. Yeah. Yeah, they're all up at the top. Hooray! Those are exiled, correct? Yeah. Um, other than a base clan, search target opponent's graveyard, hand, and library for any number of cards. That player shuffles their library, then create a 2 twos zombie creature token for each card. That player shuffles their library and creates a 2 2 black zombie creature token for each card exiled from their hand. <laughs> Cuts. And then I'll play with these five basic. Until I draw something that I want to foretell. <laughs> yeah. uh, land, Fable, yeah, see, uh, and Land. What's the blue guy? Glimpse. Oh, that's Glimpse. Okay, yeah. And then Spike is a uh, three damage, two damage. And then I can put something on the bottom to draw. Okay. Um, you know, we just pass. So the problem was because uh, I drew with the uh, I think I want one of the last. on that yeah. last day. Yeah. Uh, I drew, I think it was I think on a war of was Girl Spiral. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Girl Spiral. And I was like, there was one mana, but that's not <laughs> should be one. It's like I grow spiral and in response. It's in my graveyard. That's why I can't find yeah. it. <laughs> Beautiful. You have Swamp on your so try and land this. Yeah. Um, but I kind of want to. Yeah, that's too darn bad. Let's see what you did there. <laughs> you did that to yourself. Where's my mountain? <laughs> Do you have no basic lands? There should be two mountains. Did you there crack? Is. Oh man, I was like, did you crack the pass? Yeah. No, there, there is an island in there, but I don't need three blue for anything, so. Yeah, that would have been hilarious. Oof. Oof. We're getting sloppy. Uh, zombie's gonna attack invasion. I'm going to block. Okay. Good damage. Fable. Mm -hmm. Shock. Yep. So it's Sick Razor, Rejuvenator, and then play the four copies of. Uh, uh, I couldn't remember how this game. Okay, we did deck tech before we came out with both the Yeah, that's literally it. I did have the Alps and the Alps. So the I play a boss. It's a giant. Nobody knows that apparently. <laughs> Elder giant. Yeah, I think I take him as the lone giant, knowing you want giants. Although you have a giant. Oh, he's a goblin. Okay, yeah. 
Um, but then you can also get back there. Hmm. Either that or a glimpse, huh? Or the damage spell. How much is it? Three damage? It's three damage. Yeah. Um, I think I take the cross. Okay. Well, yep. Final answer. No, let me take the damage spell. Okay. I don't want to feed him into your graveyard. He might just come back. And go to you. Um. And we have two Zombos over there. Four four. And I uh, pass. Trigger. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna discard the glimpse of the proxy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm Sacrifice it for black. Okay. Push. Uh, okay. I can't let you have that. So I will just block the bar. Play a land. Uh, so this takes two. Mm -hmm. yes. Untap. Just wrong. Because you can play. Play my own invasion. What? Such Mill a three. Such a fun card. Oh, I had a quake bringer. One, two, three. Oh no, no dire game. Then I discard. Yeah, I will get rid of a battle of frost and fire. I'm a draw card. There's a land. I will play the land. And then I will Sega. So you draw. Cast the cross. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm just going to do all these lands. Four no. lands. And I guess the I'm going to tap one and it's fatal. Can I fatal the Croxa? No, it's not a play yet. Okay, it's just triggers happening. Oh, um. Yeah, no, you can. Yes. So it's coming into play, so there's triggers on the team. Yes, right. Sorry. So I will then fatal push the Croxa. Um, trigger. I don't feel like. Loose team. Loose team. Good for turn. You have no cards, correct? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Two at me, two at the battle. Thirteen. Yeah, I'm not slow at me. So I'm getting a Mm -hmm. Let's go blanks on the sideboard. We've been really helpful this game. Pass. Yes. I don't think I don't think it's too far. Yeah. GGS. Uh, so you got four from Quakebringer, and then I can attack for two Quakebringers. Yeah. From there. Mm -hmm. So it'd be. 
four, four from the upkeep trigger, four from that one, so that's eight. Yep. Four from a copy of that is twelve, and then those two. Yep. Good games. Jeez. I mean, game three was more of a game. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Play. If I could have. Oh, yeah, I don't have any deadly disputes. I need, really needed a deadly dispute to like get a little bit of draw. I had the token sitting there. Land, it's land, funny land. We're both playing invasion. <laughs> Nobody, I, haven't, I haven't seen anybody play it. It's a fun game. card. Yeah. It was part of the reason I wanted to go for like a dimmer uh, zombies deck. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I can just bring bring something cool back, but I also don't have like a lot of self mills, so the synergies are not very high. Yeah, I was running. So there's an is it invasion of the giants, uh -huh. and oh. I, I thought, oh, cool, like play it on two, and then you get to draw an extra card, and then you play Bone Crusher for one red, and like gives you a discount, and it just didn't work that way. And then if I milled it, it didn't do anything, and Glimpse is just so much better. Yeah. Uh, to mill and then flashback. So I made that change this week. Um, I was running two Croxes and I kept like finding them. So <laughs> the time I took one out. <laughs> yeah. Um, I think I run well. I might run three Croxes in my Rakdos deck. I run a lot of Croxes in that because it, it has a like a heavy discard sub theme. Yeah. So I'm discarding cards like really like he's a win con basically like Fjolder and Croxa are both win cons and Croxa's I'm gonna draw one of them so it's like even if one of them gets removed usually I have the other one to like yeah come in and be a big, big body I felt like I didn't really need the Croxa's but it's still like so I've got the three invasions four thought seizes and then the Croxa's so there's eight hand disruptions if you will yeah um, I've got a D side for for it later. That's the meta these days, it's kind of disruption. Yeah. Which is funny, do you remember I was playing that, uh, trying to play a discard deck for like two months? No. Oh, I played it here for like two months and I couldn't, like I couldn't get it right. I just, just never got there and I yeah. would always uh, talk about Canyon is playing a... Oh, the uh, Waste Not deck? Yeah, the Waste Not deck yeah. and I don't know how, how it's working for him, but he keeps bringing it, so he's at least having fun with it. They're always close games. Yeah. Because you disrupt your opponent's hand. But then you have to have something. Yeah, which is which is where you need uh, like with with Rakdos it works because you have Crocs that always sitting in the graveyard. Yeah. Uh, or you just like hang on to your Shieldred until you discard them out, and then you play Shieldred without right. any threat of removal yeah. or anything. And then it's just luck if they draw something. Yeah. Yeah. 